Hey guys, my name is Isabella and welcome to my ASMR channel. So before we get into today's video, I just wanted to mention a couple of things. First, I have a Patreon where for $3 a month, you can get four extra ASMR videos each and every month, along with instant access to every ASMR video I have ever posted over there. I also have an OnlyFans that you can check out, and if you're looking for a custom video, you can check out my Wizio page. And last but not least, if you'd like to follow me on Instagram, you can do so by clicking the link tree link in my description box and you can use that same link tree link to check out all of the other things that I mentioned but now let's get into today's video hey what's up are you serious you still haven't gotten an appointment this is like what the second third time third time they've rescheduled you Oh, that's annoying. Did they give a reason? They overbooked. Well, not the most professional excuse I've ever heard, but guess what are you going to do? You know, um, I don't know how you're going to feel about this, but I, I'm sure I could figure out how to give you a shave. Yeah, I mean, let me see. If you trust me, I'm willing to give it a shot. I think I could make you look pretty handsome. Of course you'd have to trust me, though. I would 100% do it. Do you want me to? Um... I mean, we're already here in the bathroom, so I have everything right here. Um, let me see. I have a razor. I have oh this. I have this oil that will moisturize and soften your hair follicles, make it easier to shave you. I have some scissors. Um, I can totally do it. I even have some extra goodies that I could use to make this like a little shave, relaxing treatment. What do you say? Do you trust me? Come on. It'll be fun. I'll be your own personal barber. You trust me enough to live with me, but you don't trust me enough to shave some hair off the side of your face. And your chin and upper lip. Well, and your neck too. You know what I mean. I can shave your facial hair. It's not that big of a deal. I promise I won't cut you. Pinky promise. And have I ever broken a pinky promise? That's right. No. So, now you have to trust me. You have to let me do it. And... They've already rescheduled on you three times. You're starting to look a little disheveled. Yeah, just, you need my help. I'm doing you a favor. Plus, I'm bored. There's nothing good on TV. So, you are going to help keep me entertained for the afternoon. Okay. So, we're just going to go with this. Um... First things first, I'm going to take this brush, I'm going to add some of this oil to the brush, and yeah, I'm just 
going to squirt a little on. First, I'll use my hands. Apply some to your facial hair. Isn't this nice and roommate bonding? Even though I'm a little insulted, but it's fine that you were so reluctant to let me do this. But I'll forgive you. And then I'm gonna add have these essential oils and it says here that lavender has a unique composition of molecules and they have properties offering a soothing feeling to the skin and that they just support overall well-being so talk about a first class spa experience. I'm gonna add some lavender. Just pour a few drops. I think three drops should be good enough. Rub it all in. Mm. It smells amazing. Doesn't that feel nice? Just using this brush to help really soak everything deep into your skin. Mm -hmm. Just close your eyes. Let me relax you. Go a little slower. Since neither of us are in a rush, you don't have an appointment to get to, and I don't have any real housewives to watch. I'm all caught up. <laughs> I know, today's my day off. So I thought I was going to be a couch potato all day, but looks like I'm a barber instead. Are you going to buy me dinner as a thank you? <laughs> no, not takeout. You're taking me out to dinner. It's not like you have a girlfriend to spend money on. Sorry, didn't mean to rub it in. You don't need a girlfriend when you have me. I'm like a girlfriend, best friend, and a amazing person, <laughs> all in one. I know I wanted to come up with a third, I couldn't think. Now, I'm going to try this, actually this new eye gel I got. I might as well make it into a little spa day. And, let's see, I haven't tried it yet, but it's a toning and age-defying eye gel. It's vitamin C kelp. I mean, you love the, the ocean. Doesn't really have a smell, right? So I'm just gonna take a little, a little bit, and rub it under your eyes.
next, kind of just making this up as I go, you haven't figured that out already, but put this lavender oil away, make some extra space, but I'll just put this entire set away under the bathroom sink. So next, I'm gonna do, this is a little lip wrap hydrating mask, I'm just gonna put some on your lips, this is really good. I'm just gonna take some and dab it on your lips and go rub it in, especially during the winter, it gets so dry, so it's really going to help you just get some of that moisture back in. Okay. Um, well, I guess it's time to shave you. Don't know what else we could possibly be waiting for. Okay, so. Um, here goes nothing. Position you a little bit. There it goes. Okay. Get this side. See, I haven't cut you yet. <laughs> Look at that handsome face. I can finally see it again. Okay, let me reposition you again. And just turn a little bit this way for me. Good. Let me get a little closer to you. Look at my handsome roommate. <laughs> Get under your chin. Do you like fish? Okay, good. Now let's go like that. Good. Okay, now tilt your head back for me so I can get under your neck. You really do, just in my opinion, look much more handsome without facial hair. I mean, don't get me wrong, you still look good with it, but you just have such a nice face that I hate when you cover it up. <laughs> Makes me much happier to be able to see all of you. I think you're almost done. 
Let me see. done. Let me take a look. I want to make sure I didn't miss a single spot of wool and give you the opportunity to possibly regret allowing me to do this. Mm -hmm. I'm just going to apply a moisturizer to your skin since it is a little drier than the rest of your face since it's been covered up with facial hair, and I don't think you were using the hydrating beard kit that I got you. I figured. <laughs> that was a good grooming kit. You should have been using it. I read a lot of reviews on Amazon before I picked that out for you for your birthday. Only the best for you. Okay, just want to really sure your skin has the opportunity to get all the moisture back in it that it lost while it was covered in all that hair. Now your neck. Down like that. Good. Very good. Okay. Well, you should send a picture to the barber shop and tell them that next time they overbook their clients, they should just send them to me. I'll get a little welcome sign, put it on the bathroom door, have my clients come in here, give them the five-star spa treatment experience. I wouldn't want to make you jealous. I'm sure you'd rather stay my one and only client. <laughs> totally messing with you. But I do expect you to take me out to dinner. And I don't know. You did want to call it a date. I mean, I wouldn't be upset. <laughs> I might even be happy. Come on. I don't think that should come as a shock. I've been flirting with you since the day I moved in, and you know it. You both know it, so let's just stop pretending. I mean, if you're not interested, that's one thing, but I think you are. Well, if that's the case, why don't we go get some dinner? We can talk about it then, and maybe I'll even let you buy me a drink afterwards. We'll go to like a wine bar or something. Perfect. I'll go get my purse. Um, here. Just brush your hair a little bit. It's a little disheveled looking. I mean, now that I have you looking so handsome with your clean-shaven face, I don't want the hair on the top of your head to ruin all my hard work. Here, let me fix you. Perfect. Looking handsome as ever. I'm gonna go grab my purse. 